okay now rendering has finished I'm just going to import the mesh from the Arial 4 here you can see some of the export setup export export particles of spin files export option for exporting particles of spin files import SD files where the particle system which uses real force emitter import a bin mesh just click the import bin mesh and just select where you have saved the mesh and just click the first image and just click load in this option box uh, you don't make any changes and click ok create ok fine now we can see some dots over here what is this if you make this to the normal 200 sorry 200 and play it you can see the drop over ok fine okay okay after you you have got this you can see the flow of the real flow effects this is the real flow effect the real liquid effect you can see okay These are the particles that fall from the tops. Okay. Okay. You can see the particles bigger than the glass. what to do we can just click the mesh and modify to center pivot and just scale it towards a little bit smaller equally on the third fourth size okay then you can see the perfect now it's perfect I think okay. you can see by clicking here you can drag it okay fine now when you play this you can get a real flow object plane and simulation okay real fine okay stop it next I'm going to just add this a material just select the punk material and just go to the color just select your, a wine color just darker color red color okay darker red and transpony of some equally after it okay just cosine power cosine power to 30 okay fine spherical to tap okay just when you render you can see the wine been mixing okay but not settled it's not settled but it's flowing over it's fine flowing from a tube or you can edit you can do anything okay just you can make her cup falling from there okay okay it looks pretty good okay fine that's it So I'm making a reverse okay you can make it perfect you can see the water stimulation particle stimulation okay you can see here particle stimulations okay Okay, that's it for now. Later tutorials, I'll be gathering 
many more important effects using Railflow and Maya. See you back 3D Maya tutorial. Thanks.